السلام عليكم برو وان سيمي دي ديد رياكشن باك ويد اد رياكشن ويد ذا ستوري اوف انجلينا جوردن بيوند جوت تالنت ذا ستوري اوف انجلينا جوردن يو اي جست اي نو جست ا بيت اباوت ذا ستوري بس نوت فور ذا ستوري اي ديسايد تو واتش ذيس فيديو اند ميك رياكشن ات سيم تايم For your fans and lovers, give me love. That's all I need. Smash the button, subscribe, turn notification on because I'm a big fan, huge fan from Algeria, North Africa, between Morocco and Tunisia. Yes, and smash the button to forget it and follow me in Instagram, Twitter means so much. And let's start with the story of Angelina Jordan Beyond Got Talent. It's coming. Angelina Jordan is a 16 year old singer who became a viral sensation when she auditioned for the 2014 season of Norway's Talent when she was 8 years old. It was so cute, this swear. Selena was born in Oslo, Norway, and began Norway. listening to classic American jazz artists when she was very young. Yeah. She continued so. to immerse herself in jazz, and around the age of five, she discovered Ella Fitzgerald, Frank Sinatra, and Louis Armstrong by combining jazz playlists on YouTube. Oh. Angelina's jazz influence was apparent during her audition, and she would go on to win Norway's Got Talent with her performance of George Dershwin's Summertime. Seven times. Why this ads? Oh my god. Why, 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 why? Mm. After winning the show, Angelina continued to perform and increase her exposure. In June of 2014, she performed Dinah Washington's Wow. The difference a day makes for the opening show of TV 2's All Sang Pa Brinson. Oh my god. <laughs> Tiny gear like addition to the front. A lot of people, yo. Oh my god. In September of 2014, Angelina performed on US television for the first time, singing Frank Sinatra's. Fly me to the moon on the Fly to the moon, I love this To the moon, I love this song Oh my In December of 2014, Angelina made her recording debut with the release of the three song maxi single My Christmas Which featured her popular rendition of White Christmas I don't see this. I don't see this. What I miss. Angelina has also given her talent to raise millions of dollars for charitable causes. In December of 2014, Angelina performed Fly Me to the Moon at Einher's Berkinder in Berlin, where she helped raise over 21 million euros for children and families in need. Wow, amazing, from kind, cute, tiny kid, do this, like, so much great. Later that month, she performed for Nobel Peace Prize recipients Malala Yousafzai and Kailash Sijarthi at the Save the Children's Peace Prize celebration. You may have noticed that Angelina sings barefoot for her performances. In 2015, Angelina published her first book, Between Two Hearts, which explains the reason she performs barefoot. According to the book, Angelina was traveling in the Middle East with her family around the age of six 
Book? I never read about this book. This is new for me. Wow. Angelina has pledged to perform barefoot every time she performs in public as a reminder of all the kids in the world who need help and support. Angelina yeah. has built an impressive she has big heart. And has recorded over 130 covers from more than 80 different artists. Her videos have generated over a half billion views on YouTube and almost 2 billion views on Facebook. Angelina created her main YouTube channel, Angelina Jordan Official, in May of 2014. The channel currently has over 647,000 subscribers and features recently released music, as well as some of her performances over the years. In July of 2017, Angelina created a second YouTube channel called Angelina Jordan Cover Channel, where she posts many of her cover videos, including her recent cover of Adele's Easy On Me. Oh yeah, I heard this. Easy, easy on me, be. Who's child? And Angelina is also popular on Instagram with over 259,000 followers. Yeah. In June of 2021, she joined TikTok, where she continues to post many of her cover videos. I'm not half the girl. Angelina returned to reality television competitions in April of 2016 when she performed Fly Me to the Moon on the first season of Little Big Shots. The following year, she performed What a Difference a Day Makes on the UK version of the show. In June of 2017, Angelina performed I Put a Spell on You. On yeah. The version of the show, and all this. Stars. And it is sound. Mm -hmm. Spelling you. In January of yeah. 2020, yeah. Angelina appeared on the second yeah. season of America. I make a Stop good talent. Again. You Prior love this. <laughs> she does so amazing job in this. Simon Cowell. Simon Cowell. Audition, the 13-year-old singer performed Queen's Bohemian Rhapsody. She do wow. I love this edition a lot, a lot. I be like, listen to this again and again and again and again and again. Never like stop. Never stop. She deserved that. She deserved to win and make a good talent. She deserved that because she. Yellow. The performance was well received, but Angelina did not receive enough votes to advance to the top five of the competition. Yeah, and she so eliminated. so bad. After Angelina's elimination in February. The young singer continued her career as an entertainer. Yeah. She currently resides in Los Angeles. And in August of 2020, Angelina announced she had signed with Republic Records. Yeah. She released her first single, Million Miles. Million Miles, yes. 2020, and currently has over Million Miles. Her latest single, Seven Heaven. Seven Heaven, yeah. 2021, and has almost 2 million streams on Spotify also. Even though Angelina did not win America's Got Talent, it looks like she is well on her way to a successful music career. Yeah, she is. Do you think Angelina should have won America's Got Talent? Let us know in the comments below, and thank you for watching. She deserves to win America's Got Talent because she has big voice and a huge voice and good personality, T amazing, 
and amazing, 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 amazing. I am big fan from Algeria, North Africa, between Morocco and Tunisia. And I know Angelina Jordan. Yo, I know Angelina Jordan, big fan. <laughs> Give me smash the button. Yo, subscribe. Give me love. That's all I need to see you in the next video. Inshallah. Thank you for watching and peace, love. Assalamu alaikum, everyone.